Hey, hi everyone. First of all, thank you for choosing the HR Topper course. So this video I have specially prepared for all my students who have enrolled for my course and they get notes. So when I'm sharing the notes, you know, so what you can do the best way to secure it, what is the process to download and some guidelines, tips and tricks that will really help you is the concept. So let's start now. The first most important, we are going to share all the notes via Google Drive. So the first thing you have to do is you have to download. I will, inf we, my team or myself, any one person will inform you that your notes have been <coughs> uploaded and now you can download from the Google Drive. So the Google Drive, the email ID that you're going to use is what you have registered with us. If you have not registered with the Gmail ID, then you have to share your Gmail ID so that I can give you the access. Am I clear everyone? So let's start. You have to go to your Gmail, Google or anything, or let's say, go to your Google. Asha, this is Google. Okay. When you open your Google with the same email ID, can you see this email ID HR topper? Okay, so your email should be the same which you have registered with us. Okay, now there is nine dot. Can you see this nine dot? There you have to click Google Drive. Click on the Google Drive and it will take you to your platform. Now, the most important part. This is your drive. This is your drive and this is my drive. So I have uploaded. Let one minute. I'll just clear it here. I have uploaded my, you know, all the course content in the folders. This is my drive. But when I will share with you, so how I normally do, I just give this access, share this, and I give your email ID. For example, a n a n d uh, 7109 at the rate gmail.com. This is what I do. Okay. And I give you the option of commenter. Most of the people I've seen, they ask for edit. Why edit? You are not going to edit any notes. First, you have to download the notes and keep it with you and do whatever you want. So don't uh, get or don't request for the editor option. If I give you the editor option and if you cut paste instead of copy paste, then an entire person may not be able to access. If you delete some uh, notes, then it will be deleted from everyone. So I don't, I cannot give you the editor option. So in the commenter, you can access it. Am I very clear? So again, I'll tell you what I normally do. I'm just taking one example of interview tips. I'm just sharing. Email ID is a n a n d 07-1083. Okay, 7-1083. Done at the rate. gmail.com i'll just reconfirm this one second now so this is yeah 71083 okay 71083 and i'm giving you the commenter option and send once i send it to you you have to open your google drive okay and go to shared with me can you see shared with me once you go Let me check. I have sent it to my email ID. Where is Google? Uh -huh. So this is my that email ID that where I've shared. I will go to shared with me. It will take some time because I've just done it. Yeah. Can you see just now it has come and it will show you from where you have where it has come. So HR topper name is reflecting and the interview tips folder also you will be able to view where under shared with me. So this is my drive and this is shared with me where I've got. So Anand has shared with you. So you can see inside this, there are two documents. Example I'm telling. Okay. Clear everyone under shared with me. Now what you have to do is you have to first download it. So the best option is right click and there's an option called download. The moment you click on download, can you see this? First is open the shared with me. Second, you can see this folder, right click and download. And now you can see this zip file is going on. Okay. Zip file is going on. It will take hardly one minute to 
zip and download automatically. Am I clear, everyone? See, it already got downloaded. Can you see this? Already downloaded in the WinZip file. So let's move. Okay. Now where we have to go? It has gone under download option. That is my, that is download. So in this download, when you will download the folder, it will get downloaded in the WinZip. WinZip. What you have to do? Now this is important. Right click and you can see the option extract all. Click here and extract. The moment you extract, it will get downloaded in the folder file. Same folder. Now click and inside all the documents are available. Am I very clear? So when you go again to my download, can you see this is a WinZip? You can delete this. Delete this. And this is the actual folder. Clear who See this folder name. Can I go ahead? So, so how, what is the process? Download, right click, download, WinZip file, extract all and you got the actual folder, how it was. So that was the first process to download it. Am I very clear the process to download? Now let's move to the next one. Now how to save the notes, the notes that you have got from HR Top or from anywhere, how to save? You have many options like pen drive, hard disk, computer. You can also take a printout and email. These are the few options available. Now there is one more option, which is the best way to secure safe, long lasting till you are alive or until Google is alive. And you can access from your mobile, from any state, world, anywhere is Google Drive. 15 GB it is giving you today's situation, 15 GB, which is more than enough for any kind of notes. Am I clear? So what you have to do is now my, this is my personal suggestion and I've taken one full, you know, one topic on Google drive. I want you to go to my uh, HR topper YouTube channel and watch uh, Google folder. You will really get an idea and importance of that and how you can utilize that. So don't miss that. So my suggestion is first, first of all, check your email ID, your personal email ID. If you have sufficient space, now, from where you will come to know the space is this one. Can you see this here? If I go to the HR topper, now this is my new one. I have created a new uh, email ID and I have 15 GB. I have 15, but I've used only 3 GB now. I've used only 3 GB now. Am I clear? But if I go to my other one, let me uh, delete this. Okay. And if I go to my HR topper, 10 GB is utilized. Can you see this? 10 GB is utilized. So you can see here, if you have sufficient, then you can use your personal one. But my suggestion again, always keep something different. Make a separate email ID. Example, Anand notes at the rate gmail.com. I have repeated the same name. Anand HR library at the rate gmail.com. Whatever, Anand Mudaliyar. Your name and the purpose is notes or make it HR library, HR notes, whatever name you want to give document. Instead of this, you can make HR document. So create a new email ID. Then what you have to do, not this. Now understand, not only the notes you can save, not only the notes you can save, but also some important documents, your certificates, your organizational documents, like your offer letter, your appointment letter, your confirmation letter, your increment letter. You can make, you know, company wise. So very systematic, one, one place, one time activity and anytime you can access and suppose you are in the interview and the person is asking for your documents immediately, you can give it the access immediately to them. So nothing wrong. All interview related things like your updated resume, anything, where, whichever you want, quick access, any kind of reports, any kind of certificate achievement, you can keep it in the Google Drive. So what I have done is example, I have created this new uh, Gmail ID and just kept a blank folder. I just kept a blank folder like education. So in this education, I'll keep my HSC, SSC certificate, mark sheet, then graduation mark sheet, certificate, then MBA. It's not mine. I'm just giving an example. MBA certificate and mark sheet. The same like ID card. Your PAN card, Aadhaar card, passport, uh, voter ID, driving license, one place, one time. Organization. Keep your company's name. Whatever company you have, ABC company, their offer letter, appointment letter like that. You can keep all things. Now, now 
the second option whatever notes you are getting from hr topper create one hr topper uh, folder okay in this folder open it and click on new can you see this new and don't go for file upload what is the meaning of file upload one file word excel what is folder upload it will take all the folders so click on folder upload okay and go to the documents where downloads where you have downloaded this one and click here upload and upload that's it so it will take some one minute time and all the documents will get uploaded see it's done hardly 10 seconds and that same documents and everything will come here so what you have to do is you have to upload all the downloaded documents from the hr top of whatever you have received or whatever documents you have done that you can keep it with you am i clear everything that means whatever you want to secure here you can upload either file wise or either folder wise so whatever documents you will get from hr topper that folder you can copy paste here or upload here am i very clear now it is safe and secure in your google drive am i clear everyone how i have done very simple again if i want to show go to your folder that you how you have created the folder right click new folder let's say abc okay example abc so in this abc i will click and new folder upload you have to upload the folder go to the folder go to the folder and upload and just hardly 10 seconds and it will get uploaded see done till it gets green color don't just wait it will give you a green signal okay so if you click here one has come one is on the way clear one has come and one is on the till the time it becomes green you need to wait don't do anything done i hope it was easy now i have told you the process keep the name as hr topper so that you are getting so many of documents and upload all the files now start uploading all your education document but keep the name name is very important label it in such a way so that it becomes so professional start uploading all the documents and keep it safe with you meanwhile if possible the same documents that you got from hr topper save it in your hard disk computer somewhere so that just as a backup file nothing wrong but second stage backup file and now this is important as per the course you have to download the notes within 48 hours or else it will be chargeable later on hardly it takes one minute five minutes Achalo, i'll give you two minutes now it takes hardly two minutes to download all the notes so please download it and keep it safe with you two minutes download two minutes upload maximum time 10 minutes i'll give you but i'm giving you 48 hours you have to value each and every seconds so 10 minutes is more than sufficient to download but i've given you 48 hours to download later on it will be chargeable and it will be very high charge clear i hope this video has helped you to the best way taught you to the best way to secure your notes your personal documents and i hope it was very clear and now you are relaxed so thank you so much clear dear chalo thank you